Hey everyone, this is Pharaoh Silver, the Pharaoh of Beer Money Finance, back with another video. And I'm wondering, should I go with Pharaoh of Finance or Pharaoh of Beer Money Finance? I'm not so sure. I've tested out both and honestly, one is better with alliteration, the other is more accurate. Uh, if you want to make your opinion heard on it, let me know in the comments below. But anyway, this is another Atlas Earth video and today we're talking about their recent updates because there has actually been quite a bit to talk about that I probably should have talked about last week, but I was on vacation and more focused on the optimal strategy guide. As you know, I don't like doing consecutive Atlas Earth videos in a row on this channel if I can help it. I'm not an Atlas Earth channel. It's a major part of this channel, but my focus is on the making money portion of things. So the first major thing that you'll probably have noticed, and I might have already talked about it, is the layout as the leaderboard and the daily login have moved to the left. But a bigger change uh, down at the bottom, you see that little star there that says events. So we've already seen the inventory. Uh, as you, oh, click on the inventory here. And you can see that this was meant for diamonds and legendary parcel upgrades and any other items they plan to have down the road. Maybe vouchers. I don't know. Now, let's go to events. And you'll see one thing that they added instead of special events, they replaced the special events with showing you upcoming events that are going on in Atlas Earth. Uh, mini games being the most common one here. So you see the next one in about two days is Atlas Warship. Uh, that is coming up. And then it looks like the following Tuesday is going to be Atlas Fishing. And then we have the Super Rent Boost event looking like around Thursday at 5. Uh, the Atlas Racer event also happening a couple hours after that. Um, then you have Atlas Golf looks like on Sunday. I believe that looks like Sunday. Anyway, yeah, so this is actually really nice in my opinion. So the reason is because instead of having to go to the Discord to find out when mini games are happening or go to this channel on the community page, you will be able to see it here on the events page instead. And that is a huge plus for Atlas Earth. Absolutely well done. I just had to give them that. So yeah, really great. Um, so if you want all the information on upcoming mini games, simply go to the events tab now. However, uh, one event they did leave out here that I should mention is on their YouTube page, their YouTube channel. They have a new music video coming out and it's called Something New. Uh, I, as of the time of this recording, I have no idea what it's about. I'm assuming it's just their new song because they got tired of the one song that everyone knows them as. So yeah, I will leave my opinions on that to the side for now, or if you want to know my real opinions, you can just join the Beer Money Network Discord. Link in the description below. The second thing is on the Atlas Earth app, so the app on the browser. We're going to go to Buy Bucks here, and you will see a few new packages being added down here. So the first one is the uh, 12,900 Atlas Buck package for $499.99, um, a little bit further down. I think I mentioned about this one in the Optimal Strategy Guide, the 140,000 Atlas Buck package for $499.99, and then three more packages here with an order button, which I assume means that you can't just simply buy it via a payment processor. So we have the 290,000 Atlas Buck package for essentially $10,000, the 1.49 million Atlas Buck package for $50,000, and the 3.2 million Atlas Buck package for $100,000. Now, my initial thoughts on this is I admittedly don't like this, um, but I understand why they're doing it. Uh, basically, you know, trying to get more bigger name YouTubers to drop in on Atlas Earth in the beginning and start promoting the channel. You know, they throw 100k Atlas Reality's way, they'll give them a whole bunch of Atlas bucks. And yeah, they would immediately enter, I think, second place if they get the 100,000 package. Uh, potentially, you would see influencers challenge whales in this way, like Stealth G605. And it also helps out Atlas Earth big time because they get an extra 100 grand going their way. Uh, that that pretty much could like pay for uh, several developers if they get enough people getting uh, Atlas Earth, pa you know, Atlas Bucks packages. And I mean, 100 grand is like, whoo, man, that's like an average developer's salary for a year. That is a really nice total. Um, so anyway, knowing that the original 100 Atlas Buck equals $5 package 
Back in the mobile app itself, set the standard early on that a parcel was worth five dollars. Um, I'm going to go ahead and do a quick uh, showing of how much a parcel is worth with each of these packages instead, as well as with the reinvestment as well. If you remember the reinvesting as uh, that we have, the reinvesting events, uh, normally we have uh, $1 equals 25 Atlas Bucks, and then on special events, $1 equals 33 Atlas Bucks. And here I made just a very quick spreadsheet. Let me actually adjust this a little better because I'm doing absolutely terrible with that. Okay, so this is just a very quick spreadsheet here of each Atlas Buck package that is available, not including the Explorer Club because the amount of Atlas Bucks that you get with the Explorer Club varies wildly based on the day that you get it. So for example, getting the Explorer Club on day 90 uh, which apparently, according to Atlas Reality, is an exploit somehow, is be is actually will get you more Atlas Bucks than if you bought it in, say, day, I don't know, 41. So um, I'm not going to put all those days here. Uh, just letting you know, though, that in almost every case, um, getting the Explorer Club is probably the better option, except for maybe the uh, in-game annual reinvest, but that reinvesting actually comes from the dollars that you've already made in game. So if you don't use them to reinvest, you will have to cash it out before using it in Explorer Club anyway. Uh, so that being said, uh, you can see here, we already are well aware that the uh, Google, right here, the Google packages, or I guess this would also be I, uh, Apple as well. I'm using Android, so I'm calling it Google. Uh, the Google packages for all but one of them, the lowest amount, the 110 for 499 on the Atlas Earth browser, uh, has the uh, cost of Atlas Bucks here. So I'm going by the cost of parcel because this one's only showing kind of just in pennies. But the cost per parcel here you see starts at 499 for the 100 Atlas Buck Google package. And on the app, it is 454 for the 110. And it makes its way all the way down. We go to the Google app and then the in-game reinvest right here. That's right, it is $4 for the cost of a parcel if you just uh, reinvest a dollar right now, which is why we heavily recommend that you, if you're going to reinvest money into the game, to at least wait for the monthly promo, which is 33 Atlas Bucks to a dollar. And now with our new packages, so you see the $4.99.99, we have $3.88 per parcel, which is about equal with the $1.99.99 Atlas, uh, Atlas Bucks package. Um, here we see $3.57 instead of $3.70 for the uh, $49.99.99, in which if you've seen the optimal strategy guide, I have recommended uh, if you want to go straight to the end game, you just buy one of these and one of these, basically. Uh, if you just don't want to deal with the Explorer Club. Uh, because there is one thing with the Explorer Club, even though the amount of Atlas Bucks that you get is more bang for your buck, the most bang for your buck, um, there is a limit to how much you can buy. So if you want more Atlas Bucks, uh, you're going to have to just buy from the packages. So you see here down here with the... $49.99.99, it is $357. The 10K package is $345 per parcel. The 50K package is $336 a parcel. And the 100K package is $312 a parcel. It's honestly leading me to wonder what's going to happen when, uh, if they ever do have like a 250K package or something. And again, as I've said, I'm not a big fan of these massive packages. It does make Atlas Earth look a little bit more... Um, wanting to push for uh, user's cash. But um, in my opinion, it is necessary for Atlas Earth to keep running. I know they're a company, they're a business first. They have to focus on getting those whales in. And again, this will be an opportunity for them to get some YouTube influencer of some sort to start promoting the game. If they put down 100,000 and they show off their, you know, 32,000 parcels and they're immediately second place passing open boosters. Well, there you go, you know? I mean, I, I'm hoping that Atlas Earth gets more uh, people promoting their game. I mean, if I'm, people have been telling me like I'm like one of the biggest names, if not the biggest name that regularly talks about Atlas Earth. And if, if so, they're in trouble. Uh, I'm sorry. For one, I'm not that big of a channel. 
uh, too. I don't entirely talk about Atlas Earth. That's about, you know, about half of my videos. Um, the main reason why I talk about Atlas Earth so much on this channel, partially because it is popular with my audience. Yes, I'm going on to a rant here. Uh, partially because it's popular with my audience. And secondly, because there isn't another uh, app out there that's making money that's giving out this many updates and have this many things going on. Like, yeah, the next three most, uh, the next three that I talk about the most, uh, on this channel, which are Benjamin, Free Cash, and Bridge Money, um, they usually give out changes once every couple of months. They don't have big events going on. They don't have any, like, massive things I have to talk about. Like, yeah, they do have deals coming in, but they're just deals. They're not like game events or something like Atlas Earth has. So that's part of the reason why Atlas Earth is just so easy to talk about. But I also try to, you know, sprinkle other things in, like the month in review, like other things like that as well. Um, and also, more recently, the Math Behind videos, which a lot of you have mentioned that you guys really enjoy the Math Behind. And I'm talking about math as well, so... I just do vi some videos, you know, once in a great while, I'll do completely to studying the math behind some obscure board game or some kind of syst or some kind of financial system out there. Maybe I might do something on that Mandelbrot, not Mandelbrot, what's it called? Martingale system or something. Uh, as an example, actually, that might be a really good financial video. But, but nonetheless, that is enough of my ranting. That is pretty much it for the update for Atlas Earth. Um, Hoping that, uh, if you guys want me to give a reaction to their upcoming music video, let me know. I'll do a reaction of some sort. Now, I'm not going to, like, show, I might, I might just do a rant. I'm not going to show, like, the entire video here because, I one, when people do those reaction videos, they're showing, like, you know, their face on the bottom left somewhere. And, like I've said, I'm never doing a face reveal. So, that's not happening. But I can give my thoughts on the music video if you want and to see if it is better or cringier than the I just bought more land in the metaverse um, little uh, musical number that they had a year or so ago. Uh, yeah, so let me know in the comments below if you want to see that amongst other questions. That's pretty much it, everyone. If you like this video, give it a like, subscribe to Beer Money Engine, and I will see you all next time. This is Pharaoh Silver, signing off. Bye, everybody.